What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Shamarty John. Back again with another shoe review video. You already know who it is. You already know who it is. What'd that say? Somewhere in America. Side Collective, my favorite brand. Like, no, that's no cap, my favorite brand. I started following Side Collective on Instagram and I regret that I did not know him enough time to get his memberships, to get some of the older shoes. But I actually have some shoes called the McFlies, the McFly Skates that just came in yesterday. So I actually already gonna check the shoe out. I done cleaned it up. Um, I got it for a really great price. It wasn't dirty or anything, but I just wanted to add some whitening to it and around the soles. And then I bleached the shoelaces to make them more white. But yeah, we got the McFly Skates. And bro, this shoe is so beautiful. I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna color correct this video. So you can really see the shoe. Like, look, I'm not even holding it close to the camera, right? Look how beautiful this shoe is from where you're sitting at. And like, since I let the laces slo uh, soak in like Clorox and, and washing detergent for like a few hours and let them dry out, I wash, hand wash and let them dry out, they look so beautiful. Like, I don't think camera does not do this shoe justice it don't do it justice and the qualities of my videos not to toot my own horn but for someone that records on the iphone 13 pro max my videos the quality be banging you can't even lie like bro look at this traditional diamond stitching on the back and it feels different i don't even I can't even tell like what material this is. And people say that membership, I don't know if this was a member exclusive shoe or not, but if you go to Sia Collective's Instagram and you look at his shoes, like scroll all the way down, scroll all the way down and go to his FBCC page, his other page that's verified, and especially his FB, uh, FBCC when he first got started, and tell me what shoes are a miss on there. Tell me what shoes, now every shoe might not hit to you or whatever, but even if it don't hit for you, you can't say that the shoe is, is ugly. You can't say it. Like all of his shoes are hard. Like every single one of them. Like he does not miss. And people, you know, some people were saying membership ain't worth it. You know, I just not found out about him, but I felt like I missed out not knowing about him sooner and not being able to grab a membership because all of the stuff in the membership is hard, bro. Everything is just straight. Like, look at this. Look at this. And it's like the color changes as you move the shoe around. Look at this, bro. I'm so glad I bleached the laces. They weren't dirty or nothing or whatever, but yeah. If I don't buy straight from him, I, I'm going to bleach the laces. I might just bleach the laces anyway just to get them extra white. But, bro, like, I got this shoe. Shout out to the person, the seller who, uh, who gave me the shoe. If you ever see this video, bro, you know what I'm saying? Like, look at, I, I cleaned the uh, the soles, whatever, for the, you know, for this video, whatever, but the shoe is in great and perfect condition. Like, just look, look, how, look at that. Like, this shoe is just perfect. I'm so happy that my friend told me about this shoe and told me that I should get it. Like, camera really doesn't know just, like, look how beautiful the colors are. Hold on, bro. Let, we we got to get a closer look. We got to get a closer look, man. This shoe is just beautiful, man. Look at that. You see how the color just shifted? Look at that. Green, pink, yellow, orange. Oh, back to red. Like, look at that. I can't even properly pan up and pan down because it that just, you won't get the full enjoyment of the shoe. Look, look at how white the laces is. If you want your laces whiter, like just let them soak in Clorox. 
and washing detergent powder. Like, this shoe is beautiful. I'm so happy with this purchase. Yo, Dev, Devlin, ain't nobody beating you with this right now, bro. It's like one of you every so hundred years, man. Jeez. Gorgeous. Straight gorgeous. Just straight beautiful. Side collective emblem right there, white insole. Got a place in there where you can tuck the laces. All right, y'all, so, so I can try to get more in detail so this right here, like the inside of the uh, of the strap, it's like real leather. That's real leather. Yeah, even right there, you see where the Velcro is at? That's leather that's around it. Ish, man. People can say whatever they want. Like, look, at, like, look at that right there, bro. This should be the thumbnail, honestly. Like, hold on, hold on. Let me see if I can. All right, I was trying to take the thumbnail. That's gonna be the thumbnail, like. Yeah, let's get these on. Like, these look so beautiful. I don't even wanna put them on or wear them. Like, let's get them on foot. For those of you who bought it to care, it came in this box right here, the regular box, but it has the handle on the back. So you can hold it like this, which is fire. On the back, they got the the dead vulture right there. Then on the front of where the shoe is displayed, underneath it, it has the SIA logo, the SIA, and you see somewhere in America, regular box. Size 10, as you see, McFly, Vulture Skates by SIA Collective. Just wanted to show that real quick before we take it outside, just in case, you know, y'all care. Each shoe came in this plastic. I usually keep my shoes in here when I'm not wearing them. So I get like some clear containers or something like that, whatever. But yeah, that's what it came in. Now let's get these on foot. All right, y'all, so we are outside kind of in the shade right now because I, I gotta walk out to, to um, so the sun can really hit it but this is them on foot <clears throat> sorry for the loudness of all the traffic that's going by but I left one side unstrapped this is how I laced them or whatever I made sure that the lines were um I made sure that the not the lines the laces were perfectly nice and flat I mean usually when you get up here to the top part of it that's when it's, it, you know, starts to become a little crease, whatever. And that's, that's going to happen because it's going to be a lot of slack there or whatever. But I wore one side un unstrapped and the other side strapped so y'all can see how both of them look. Or you can do like this. Just put it to the, um, the first Velcro.
like my cloud shorts naruto cloud shorts go ahead and check out the review on those i'll put the card in the um in the video so y'all can see them back to saya the mcflies so let's go ahead and walk into the sun Every time I record, it's always a loud plane that's going over. So right here, this little area, you can tuck the, a the access laces in, but honestly, I don't think that it's, um, Maybe I just didn't do the laces long enough to where, or have enough slack in them to where they can fit in there or whatever. Yeah, I can't, I can't get it, but yeah. I just wanted to point that out a little bit more. But yeah, those are the McFlies. If you have enjoyed this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. In a few hours, God of War Ragnarok will be dropping. I'm pretty sure a lot of people have already beat the game and I've heard some people even had the ending up already. And that's for people who get like exclusive, like a, an additional day access to play the game. So even like one of my favorite YouTubers, Corey Kenshin, even put his first um, playthrough part one up and I'm not gonna watch because I don't want to spoil the game for myself. But um, yeah, I'm gonna try to record some footage of my own so for those of you all who's interested in gaming you know make sure you check it out you know give it a watch but peace